Hi, I'm Stefania and I work for Freedom Pro. Today I'm going to tell you a little bit about our company and our products. Freedom Pro is a small Italian company specialized in the production of technologically advanced solutions for the smart home. We have developed a product called EasyCon for KNX. As you probably know, a KNX plant is dependable and safe, and that is guaranteed by the KNX standard together with the professional's experience. On the other hand, we have Apple, Google and Amazon Alexa, and they also represent safety and reliability. The combination of the KNX standard with the platforms that control the smart home is ensured by EasyCon for KNX a bridge certified by Apple, Google, Amazon, IFTTT and integrated with OMA system. EasyCon for KNX allows you to control both pre-existent and new home automation systems using apps, voice control, automations and themes from Apple, Google, Amazon, IFTTT and OMA system. Installing EasyCon for KNX is easy, intuitive and quick. You just need to connect the power supply and Ethernet cable at the top and the bus at the bottom. The power supply must be 12 or 24 volts, alternating current or direct current, and the power consumption is negligible, only 100 mA. The Ethernet cable enables the communication on the local network and with the clouds from the smart platforms. The IP address is automatically assigned by the router for better compatibility and speed of installation. The KNX bus is directly connected to EasyCon for KNX without needing an additional KNX IP gateway. It is possible to map the accessories simply by accessing the configuration page of the EasyCon for KNX. To reach the configuration page, simply reach the EasyCon IP address. You can search for the IP address in the router pages or through network scanning software. We are using the free software LensScan on a Mac computer. Once the configuration page has been reached, we can sign in by pressing the access button on the front of EasyCon. Now it is possible to start the accessory mapping phase. To facilitate this phase, it is possible to import the ETS project file in KNX project format, but it is also possible to insert the group addresses manually. The first step in configuring an accessory is to press the plus button and choose the category of accessory you wish to configure from the many available. If for example we configure a light, we are prompted to enter the control group address and status address for the on-off parameter through which we can configure an on-off light. We can enter the group addresses manually or search for them in the tree of the imported KNX project and drag them into the dedicated field. Depending on the accessory chosen, different configuration parameters will appear, some mandatory and some optional. In general, each parameter allows you to specify a command group address to control a function of the home automation system and a status group address to know the status of the same function of the home automation system. We give a name to the accessory and save to complete the mapping of the accessory within EasyCon for KNX. Continue with the configuration of all, others, all other accessories of the KNX bus-based home automation system. When you have finished configuring all the accessories, it is advisable to make a backup copy of the configuration centered in EasyCon. As we anticipated, thanks to EasyCon, it is possible to control the KNX system through the smart home control platforms such as Apple, Google, Amazon Alexa, IFTTT and Home Assistant. The system can be controlled through Apple Home by framing the QR code and adding EasyCon as an Apple HomeKit certified accessory. The application will start a customization process of all the accessories previously mapped within EasyCon for KNX, where for each accessory it will be possible to choose the room of the house where to place it, if you want it among your favorites, and a few other customizations. EasyCon for KNX is compatible with Google Assistant and Amazon Alexa. 
it is necessary to make the Google and Alexa clouds talk with the Freedom Pro cloud. When entering the Freedom Pro website, simply go to the Freedom Pro cloud interface. You can choose whether to log in with your Google account or your Facebook account, according to your preferences. Proceed with the login. The cloud will search for your EasyCon for KNX, and once it has been found, you can enter the 8-digit code on the front of EasyCon to complete the pairing of the device. At this point, all you need to do is open the Google Home app and search for the Freedom Pro service, or the Amazon Alexa app and search for the Freedom Pro skill. Proceed with the access to the Freedom Pro cloud and wait a few moments for the devices to be made available on the app used. EasyCon for KNX allows you to control the KNX bus also through third parties such as IFTTT and Home Assistant. To use IFTTT, you need to combine EasyCon for KNX with the Freedom Pro Cloud profile, as required to use Google and Amazon Alexa. Open the IFTTT app or go to the website, create your applet choosing the start trigger and the action to be performed from the many configuration possibilities. To use Home Assistant, you need to obtain the API key from your Freedom Pro Cloud profile. Then go to the Home Assistant interface, go to the menu configurations, integrations, add integration, search for Freedom Pro and use the API key. You are now ready to create your automations with Home Assistant. You can ask us for support or any information by opening a ticket or chat directly from the Freedom Pro website and clicking on the blue dot at the bottom right.